So I noticed that no one's booked my property and we went into the calendar area. I'm seeing this price missing error and I'm going to show you how you can fix that in case you're having same issue with me. So what really the cause of this is you haven't set up your standard pricing in booking.com but there's a quick way to fix that. So first is you need to go into the calendar click on the calendar and pricing and then calendar um, double check if there's any error just like this if you cannot see this kind of look you probably set the view into a list view so calendar in booking.com has a different view it has this view which you can also see but like it's better i prefer the monthly view you can also do the yearly view which like this you can also see the yearly view but yeah i just want to do the monthly view so i can make easy adjustment so to do that you just need to click on any of the date that has a price missing and then in here it said start february 2024 and i'm gonna end that into maybe 2030 which is super enough for me to you know um, make a bulk adjustment so currently in here open or close for booking obviously i want it to be open um i'm gonna remove um, i'm gonna dis exclude this one also later so this one um i'm gonna make it to two or fifty dollars and then i will just just hit save and you should be good to go i believe so it might take for a while especially if you make a you know you you've done a super long booking so it says something there's an error so let's refresh that but we should be good to go in here so this one make sure you close oh it's already close so it's not overriding the other um other booking that is already close and this one is actually close um it's a booking.com um, it's an Airbnb booking. It's a manual booking from one of my mom's friend. So yeah, you just need, it's just easy to do a bulk update into your calendar. I really like to do different variation of pricing. So if they stay longer, obviously we can provide a discount. So um, simply click on the rate plans in here and then there is also like some sort of um type of plan so flexible is a refundable plan but it's it will be more expensive than non-refundable um i can add that rate so if it's non-refundable um they it's a 10 percent lesser which you can also configure if you want to make it if you want it to be um 20 percent you know 20 percent lesser then um you can make adjustment to the rate plan now it's not just a flexible and non-refundable plan they also have a weekly monthly and early booker so if i'm gonna hit on early book booker i would love to give um if they book at least maybe before 15 days then it's non-refundable it's under the non-refundable and then I would love to give them maybe 10% discount. Mm. Early booker, I think. I just want a 10% discount for that. Um, actually, just 5%. I prefer to give the 15% discount for longer stay. So in here, add a new rate plan. So if it's a weekly, I want to give them an extra. Um, I don't want them to do a refundable, but I'm happy to give them 15% discount for weekly. And then 20% discount. So let's double check. Or... So for the monthly, 
I'm happy to give them 30%. So what's the 30% of that? Let me double check. 30% discount. Yeah, I'm good with that. So I'm happy to give them 30% discount for the monthly. Maybe for the early booker, I'm going to give... So yeah, I'm fine. Early booker will be 5%. Weekly would be 15% cheaper, 30% for the monthly. Because there's still other promotion as well. Um, The good thing with this one is I own the property. So, and I already paid the mortgage. It doesn't really, you know, so um burden on my part to give discount and then in here as well under the promotion if you want to expand your reach and you know um increase your conversion they have this promotion in here so i added something like extra 10 percent discount if they use mobile and then you can also add something like here so they have a lot of things like last minute booking, I'll be happy to give. Um, I'll be happy to give ten percent. I'm fine with that. Um, that would be last minute booking, two days. How much discount you want to give? Um, yeah, I'm fine with ten percent. Ten percent for two two. Let me double check. How much is that? Yeah, I'm fine with that. 10% discount and there's another discount in here early early 2014 recommended 25% discount budge for exposure 25% discount is so big dude It's so big, 500. From April, December 25. Okay, let's do that. I'm fine with that. I just need to increase a little bit my, like my pricing maybe. I'll make it two or three instead of yeah, so I'm going to go into the calendar and then um, this one, let's do a bulk until 40. I know I it's super crazy like in terms of pricing. I just want to make sure that um, I just prefer them to book longer stay. So like it's still like uh you know a break even because you need to pay for your caretaker to do all the processing so i'd rather to them to um book longer versus on like you know one day booking so i don't want that hassle thing so i just want to add extra 100 passes or two dollars for the booking um your promotion on this date yeah, I know it's too low, but for sure, if the price is still low, they will book more than one day. So I'm fine with that. Um, Non-refundable. So yeah, mm. they're going get, to get one five if they book longer. So I'm actually going to do two four. Yeah, I'll do two three for all of them until 2024 but on february so let's just do that so this one is two two for non-refundable and then so what will happen is the standard pricing for my two bedroom is 2300 or almost 50 dollars and then um if they choose weekly then they will be only paying 1800 and if it's monthly it's only 1500 and for the non-refundable um i'll be happy to give that to them to 2100 and i'm gonna hit on save mm. so originally it's 2-2 but flexible is 2-2 weekly is 1800 
monthly is 1500 um but here there is a 25 percent promotional deal from feb 1 to april which is obviously um it's too cheaper it's cheaper compared if they open to a monthly you know monthly stay so i'm gonna adjust the feb until april until april 30 and i want the price to be 2400 so if they get this 25 percent off it's not too you know it's too it's not too big so hit on save oh prices for non-refundable let's make it two two i'm fine with that open okay so here you go flexible is which is then refundable is 2400 non-refundable is 22 early bird is you're only gonna get get it um 2k weekly is 22 monthly is 1560 um mm. yeah i think that's that's fair enough so like the mm. reason why i'm willing to give lower price for my yeah. property because i want to expand my exposure i don't want to um, make more effort in you know advertising i uh, i let booking.com do that for me and yeah as you notice you'll get more they get, you will be added to their 25 percent early 2024 deal campaign which will have more you know exposure versus another property that did not open to the campaign so i want to take advantage of that um yeah i'm willing to to compromise my return of revenue for that and yeah that's how you can work and play around with your pricing um yeah 